Ever wondered about the rich man's encounter with Jesus in the Gospel of St. Mark, chapter 10, verses 17 to 27? Picture a man with everything, yet feeling empty. He asks Jesus, what must I do to inherit eternal life? Jesus tells him to follow the commandments. The man, confident, claims he's done that his whole life. But Jesus sees his heart, knows his true struggle. One thing you lack, Jesus tells him, go, sell everything you have and give to the poor, then you will have treasure in heaven. Then come, follow me. The man leaves, saddened. He had great wealth, you see. Jesus then talks about how hard it is for the rich to enter God's kingdom. But remember, with God, all things are possible. These verses remind us that wealth can be a dangerous thing. It can lead us to put our trust in material possessions rather than in God. When we do this, we are putting ourselves at risk of spiritual shipwreck. If we are wealthy, we need to be careful not to let our wealth become a stumbling block to our salvation. We need to remember that God is the source of all true wealth and that we should put our trust in Him rather than in our material possessions. If we are not wealthy, we need to be careful not to envy those who are. We need to remember that God loves us just as much as He loves the wealthy and that He has a plan for our lives, regardless of our financial situation.